What's our course, Captain? Ranger Bay, Quartermaster. We're sailing for the coast of Africa.
Working on it hard! Fire! She's a good sailor. Now poop. Brief the topsail and gallant. I'm off Mother. to find Roberts. Don't stay long. Crew's getting restless up. Give me some speed. Aloft, lads. Shake those steps.
Captain Kenway. Yet another dire situation, Roberts. We really must stop meeting like this. Stop tailing me and your wish had come true. There's no need for this. You know I'm as good as my word. Our Captain Howell was killed today in a Portuguese ambush. Ed strong fool. I warned him not to go ashore. It was orchestrated by the Templars, Burgess and Cockrum. The same sort that took you to Havana. Ah. I see now there is no escaping the Templar's attention, is there? I suppose it is time to fight back. I do like the sound of that. And I know just how I'll do it. But these men, Burgess and Cockrum, they cannot be allowed to leave with word of my escape. They won't. Count on it. If you spot any men from my crew, do them some kindness and send them here. I'll do all I can. Only what can carry maggots. We're not waiting on no one.
up your socks and grab your cocks. This ship is sailing. You did us good, Kenway. Proved yourself a true bravo. And for what? His own bloody pride. You stepped in the path of my prize. Not a thing a man should do. <laughs> a cocksure, Cully. Just like Hornick all said. That Templar scab means nothing to me. None of you do. And you're worse for it, Kenway. It were the Templars who took us in when all else went to shit. Not our king. Not our country. The Templars. The Templars is our family. Where's yours? In honest service, there are thin commons, no wages and hard labor. Yet, as gentlemen of fortune, we enjoy plenty and satisfaction, pleasure and ease, liberty and power. So what man with a sensible mind would choose the former life when the only hazard we pirates run is a sour look from those without strength or splendor? Ha. Now, I have been among you six weeks. And in that time, I have adopted your outlook as my own. And with so fierce a conviction that it may frighten you to see your passions reflected from me in so stark a light. But, if it's a captain you see in me now, I then, I'll be your bloody captain. Yeah! For I have dipped my hands in muddied waters, and, withdrawing them, find it better to be a commander than a common man! You fatten with your assistance. I'm looking for the observatory. Folks say you're the only man that can find it. Folks are correct. Despite my distaste for your eagerness, I see in you a touch of untested genius. I'm Bartholomew Roberts. Edward. I have no secrets to share with you now. But if you'll lend me your aid, in two months' time west of the Leeward Islands, well, it's there you'll get some answers, I promise you. Funny that. With scurvy, the fix is more pleasant than the cause. When you catch a dose from a horn, must treat it with quicksilver. You're fonder of getting the disease than you are of curing it. Something biting at you. Oh, all men desire to live by a code or a creed, yes? Yet when pressed, most defer to their instincts rather than the laws that bind them. What is the appeal of a creed if it does not yoke all men to like behavior? Might make a man feel like he belongs to something. What's your answer? Ah, oh, that all men are sheep. That an old wolf like me deserves every ounce of blood he draws. Sail to this location. Bring only those you trust.
Grazie, my thanks. I'm your man now, Capitano. Wave the bra! Captain Kenway, should we use your ship for this next scheme or mine? At first, you have the details before deciding. Oh, it's a small gambit. This fount of information has just told me that a nearby galleon contains the treasure I seek. For his sake, I hope he's right. You've thought this plan through. Indeed. And using this man will acquire a Portuguese flag, which will get us as close to our target as possible. It's a very simple idea, if you follow my orders to the letter. The jackdaw, then. Excellent. We're underway, Rollins. So what's your plan? The flagship of this fleet is transporting a valuable treasure in a large chest. Crystal files filled with blood. You may remember. We're chasing drams of blood. Is that all? I asked you to follow my instructions to the letter, Captain. But I did not give you leave to question why. I want those blood files intact. And if that does not happen, we part as enemies. Do you understand? I'll try to, I. Do I? 
There's the thing for us, Captain. You see that ship here? We'll need its flag for this ruse to work. If I can steal that flag without disturbing so much as a flea, I'll do it. By all means, try. Commissar Falag. Oh, good. If the bills are in soil, they will drop. Que Deus o guarde e proteja, senhor. Como se encontra nesta noite tão formosa? Muito bem, muito bem, obrigado. É, só um pequeno conceito, um desmóvel, que eu sou todo bem, um pouco forte. Está tudo em ordem por este lado? Sim, senhor! Tudo em ordem! Got the flag. Aye, and we're flying it now. This should do nicely. I'll keep my distance, slow and steady. Aye, the flag we stole won't protect us from eyes that pry too long. Por favor, senhor, implore que considere aquilo que está prestes a fazer. Now it was even. What's he whinging about? He's not whinging. He's a static. <laughs> something from that ship could that be our prize perhaps you should go ashore captain kenway find that chest and if it contains the prize i see Oh, 
despistar o seu monte de Ouvi uma história sobre um espanhol que veio visitar o nosso almirante. Cá para mim. Por muito que a maldição é a minha, a verdade. 